Welcome back to another video on Ian's Trains. This is layout update number 9. I have a decent amount of work, so let's get right into the video. Starting over here, you can see that I got an MTH house for here. Um, I'm not done scenicing around it, but so far, it's really making that area over there look really good. Moving back, I got work done on my ramp over the railroad tracks. I got the ramp done, I got this little transition, and I have these pieces of wood between the tracks, and I just need to finish up over here. I ballasted the track, uh, I did this the other day, um, I got in a new bin of ballast from Woolen Scenics, that's what the ballast I use, and it's really making this area look good. And then over here, I also redid a portion of the ballast over here because it wasn't looking the greatest. I may redo it over here, but I think I kind of look the way it looks. And then over here on the side, again, I ballasted here. This ballast is not secured down. And then I've ballasted all the way back there. I still need to do that side in between the track. Over in the back of the layout, you can see that Atlas building. Um, I started working on it. I added some paint. Um, after having it for well over a year and a half, I finally decided um, th to work on it. I think I've had this building close to two years now, maybe two and a half. Um, but I decided to work on it. If it doesn't come out great, that's okay. I'm just trying. It's the first building kit I've completed. but So I think it'll look pretty good when it's done. Over here, I've done quite a bit of work. Um, I tore up some of this stripping on the side of the tracks, and I redid it. Um, I'm going to be building a little support up here. I think everything will look really good because with just this, it looked very flat. And I want to get a little bit of a girder bridge look, so I think that will make the area look really good, and it will add a lot of detail. It's not the easiest spot to get, but you can see I did some work over here. I have this piece of foam board in as a wall, and I have some cardboard on top of some grass. I also have some two smaller wooden retaining walls, and I still have to get some stuff to finish it, but I think right now it's looking really good for the progress it has had. Over here, I have done some work to the layout. If I move the scenery container, you can see I got some track bumpers. For here, I still need a third one for here, but once I get that third one, I'm going to ballast between the tracks and add some grass on the sides, and everything's going to start looking really good. Over here, you can see on this outer yard track that I started to ballast, um, I just need to do back here, and then I can fill in the grass, and then do over there. Over here, I put my, might put a small structure, I'm not sure. But this area is starting to look really well. And then over there, I did a little bit of grass. It's hard to tell. I didn't do it very well. Um, when I sprayed it with some glue, it kind of ruined it. So I think I might have to redo some of this grass over here. So that will be all for today's video. There's not a huge amount of work I've done to the layout. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.